What's up, people? Welcome back to the Homeless Crusade. It's been a we took a uh, like a young sabbatical. Okay. For you guys, it might not seem like that, but yeah, we actually, we we actually took a break. So we took a, a break for Ramadan. Yeah. Because um, yeah, we can't put the homie under pressure to edit, and then right. like you know, he has some religious commitments and shit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we don't want to do that to the boy. Yeah, yeah. So we took a we took a bit of a break, but we, as you know, we film in advance, so we we'll always had episodes. Talk about all this other stuff. Well, yeah. OG three and that, but right yeah. now we have a guest in studio. We have some guests in studio, guys. Please, we we don't want to get your your pseudonyms wrong. So <laughs> let the people know who you are. Yeah. You need to drop the government name, but just let them yeah. know who you are and where they can find you. Okay. Hi uh, peeps, we out here at the Homeless Crusade, it's your boy Prince Chido in Tuanang Eko Plow, in Tuanang Alal, in Tuanang Alal, in Tuanang Atwali. It's a long ass suit in them, dog. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yo! That would not went well. Yo! So. <laughs> I was gonna have a whole paragraph at the bottom of the screen <laughs> now with that whole... <laughs> nah, man. <laughs> I just gotta make sure, man. Make sure they know. Make yeah. sure they know, yeah, yeah. Yo, yo, this is Stanko Badman, Stanko Stana from the hood, from the Plower. Yeah, yeah, I'm with my homie Chido. Um, I'm a rapper, producer, and yeah, um, my Twitter is Tanko Batman, same as Instagram, and that's it. Mm. Oh, yeah. Thanks, guys. Thanks for being here. Yeah. Oh, we yeah. know we, uh, it was a bit of a Just painful to pull morning. Back the curtain a bit, we were yeah. struggling. Yeah. We were yeah. struggling yeah. for a minute, yo. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. And then yeah. my Asian gene kicking super hard. <laughs> And I fixed things. all my, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, now, but I need to pay yeah, a much yeah. to my ancestors. They came down and they were like, go to settings yeah. and just fix this. Thing. Change <laughs> setting to podcast mic. I was like, yes, great grandfather. I hear you. Made that shit happen. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? When you get stuck, guys, when you get stuck, call your Asian friends. Call your Asian friends. That's the new thing I learned. Get stuck, call your Asian friends. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You know? Get stuck with anything. Thing, bro. Yeah. Yo, okay, if my toaster stop working, Gito, just do this, bro. You know, <laughs> make the toast will pop up out of the. You know? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, yeah. But anyways, yeah. guys. So I, I, w- I wanted to ask because I'm sure there, will, there will be people who do know. There will be yeah. people who don't know. Um. So what kind of music do you guys make? Yeah, that was my intro, like introducing myself. Where yeah. am I? So now we're gonna go get into basic of what we do. Yeah, yeah. 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 I'm a rapper. Trapper, musician, songwriter. Mm. I don't produce. What I want. Mm. They must know this. For sort for cuts. So. <laughs> no, you yeah, can't. Oh, yeah, <laughs> sure, man. I'm a trapper, <laughs> so as I said. So, so yeah, like PG-16. Yeah. Yeah. Started doing this thing back in like 2012. Yeah. Oh, yeah. damn. We've been at it for a while. Yeah, it's 10 yeah, years yeah. since we're working with this guy now. This oh, year. Right. Yeah, yeah. A solid 10. That yeah, we have yeah. proper music out. Mm. Yeah, yeah, even though it's not out there. Uh, I had kind of like took a break from music for quite some years due to unforeseen circumstances of life, you oh, know, yeah. man. Mm. Do you know how many, can you say how many years, or was it like a... a it was a lot of years, maybe yeah. four. <laughs> Time oh, okay. flies, guys. Like, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. yeah. COVID, yeah. COVID hit everyone. Yeah, yeah. 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 Flies, yeah. COVID hit Shut everyone. Yeah, but yeah. see when... Yeah. But then, we kept on recording, recording, storing music in the vault, which is wrong. But yeah. one thing about us, we don't want to drop trash. Yeah. That's my motto. Get it right, then yeah, you know, like... Yeah. Hmm. So today, when Steve unfortunately is not here, yeah. that's my that's team. A different story, but yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's another different story. <laughs> so Steve and I wanted basically to talk about the industry because mm-hmm. here at the Homeless Crusade, you talk about various stuff, yeah. Yeah. like a lot of stuff. You have different people from different industries. One hundred percent. So yeah, I'm here just to state on the industry. PE, yeah. the Kabeh, I want to ask you yeah, a lot about that. Like yeah. I want to ask about the shows and the bookings and the sure. albums that time. But yeah. go ahead, go ahead. So we, uh, I, I just want to voice out my opinion without okay. shooting shots at anyone 100%. or whatever. I ain't mm. into no beefy or whatever. <laughs> no and yeah, right. and I ain't no cloud chaser. If you're real with me, I'm real with you. Mm. Just like that. 100%. So now, what we're failing at, so since I was like away from the making of the music, I was just studying the music business. Mm-hmm. Yeah, boy, knowing where to go, how to do this shit. Like the business aspect of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. the oh, business yeah. side. Yeah. Not the music making side. Yeah. That's art. Mm-hmm. You see, that's my mm-hmm. art. So yeah. now you got to have that background knowledge of what you want to do. How to make a move, mm-hmm. how to, where to go. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Stuff like that. So. And then the first thing we lack is registration, guys. Mm-hmm. Registration. Because I see everyone is on DSP is fine. I was talking like the distro and yeah, you, know, you see, you stuff. see those things. Mm. Uh, the sad truth about those things is, 
they owned by major like the major companies mm. the major record labels mm. they own those things mm. now you don't make a lot of money out of that thing sure. yeah. and what imagine like yeah it's like sense per song yeah, yeah. yeah. you don't make money you make off sense that per shit. song and yeah. they streamed or downloaded there's no money yeah. there's no money in that shit and then now the sad part is that we don't have an industry in PE or hip hop mm. mm. there's no industry well, I, okay, I, I don't know. I think Kevin can also speak on this because he's very, very involved in like the dance sure. side of things and whatever. But um, I don't think I think it's more of a support issue, man. Because I'm saying it's a support yeah. issue. Yeah. Bruh, okay, you can speak from what you're sure, sure, you sure, sure, sure. But I just think also it's a case of like, bruh, the people don't want to come out to the shows. Like I'm, I, I don't like. Um, I wouldn't say house like the piano type yeah, of yeah, yeah, events, yeah, yeah, you know, because yeah. obviously it draws a certain crowd, whatever. But like I look out for the hip hop events, I True. go to those. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. So it's like if the, if we push that more, then I think the people who come out of the woodwork, the people that want to go to these types of events, do you know what I'm saying? So but the other problem is on the other side of the coin, the Ama Piano v- events are way more popular. Oh, yeah. of course, when yeah. I they, it's, Piano is yeah, it's like kind of like the center of in the world internationally. Yeah, it's the center so of like uh, if you want to call it like the performance art, mm. like music genre the, category the, right the now. There was a time though. Long time ago, there was a time where there was a movement for hip hop. Oh yeah, GE. there was yeah. like mm. lit hip hop events where you know you go. Your Gondwanas. Well, mm. you go, you know the whole yeah. set, yeah. you know the DJs and stuff yeah. like that. Now I'll say there's mo- most probably like one DJ for hip hop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you mm. get that he's also trying to crowd please, where you will be playing yeah. mm. old mm. stuff mm. like. You know what you said in Nagda, but yeah. the only person I can think of who's a really dope hip hop DJ is yeah. Blaster. 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 He's no the first person that came yeah. to my mind. No competition. And, and that's, and that's he's the first all, yeah. person, genuinely. So, mm. also there's that also. Yeah. If you if there will be like an event where. I don't care if there's no niggas performing, just DJs, yeah. just hip hop DJs. Where yeah, like, yeah. but they dude scratching and yeah. stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Like every, yeah. Yeah. every set is like yeah. hip hop. Yeah. And you, yeah. most probably you, there will be people coming out to support that because yeah. there's mm. true like hip hop people who yes. want to go to strictly hip hop events. What I so I think that all like covers that. Yeah. And it covers all the stuff where we're saying there's no hip hop movement, there's no hip hop industry yeah. because there's nothing happening, basically. Yeah. So something that I want to actually, uh, that I want to touch on because it's kind of on what you were speaking about. Yeah, yeah. So in in Feb we went to um, Red Bull BC One and we did like wouldn't say coverage. We just went to go and check out the event and kind of yeah, shed yeah. light on it because people don't know about it. Right? Yeah, it's yeah, like yeah. A, it's literally an international competition that comes Red through. Bull sponsored as it's, well. it's a Red Bull event, yeah, yeah, right? Yeah. It's it's an actual a, a Red Bull founded event where, but it's mainly for like break dancers like b boys and b girls. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. what what happens is, you come through, you compete. If you if you place in the finals. You get to go to the national final of whichever country that you're in. So yeah. the P, like the guys who compete in PE, the national final was in K- oh. Joburg, oh, okay. was in Josie, right? And if you win in Josie, you go to globals, yeah, yeah, which yeah. is so, all so the dudes from all around the world. Yeah. But the the what was what was fascinating to me was we had some interviews after the event was over, and even Adel and Steve's were like, "Yo, this playlist of whoever was playing is sick," but it was Malaysia. Yeah. But the point is like. The event itself wasn't bad. People came to come support the dancing. People came to come support whoever they were, yeah, whoever yeah. they knew was competing. Mm-hmm. But when it really popped off, was only at the after party, right after the event ended, because people thought that it was an event happening at the gallery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Meanwhile, it was the after party for BC One, uh, and Lester yeah, was one of the DJs. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Lester was one of the because remember, party, yeah. remember when we were doing the interviews, bruh? People were like were filing in, in, like they were in a queue to I get mean, inside. Were actually, going to. To not the event per to se, the, the after, after party, party yeah. of the yeah. event. Yeah. It's gonna be coma, piano, the club. And yeah. 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 that's yeah. what they came the for. Yeah. But yeah. it was yeah. a hip hop event as well, so fair enough. But yeah. the point is that all the people that I saw after we got done doing our interviews did not watch a single battle because they weren't there for that. <laughs> they came for the club yeah. afterwards. Yeah. So that's what I noticed. And um, but it's it, it, it is a it, it really is a supporting brand. Yeah. I I see it myself with like with like visual art. Myself, uh, yeah, it's, it's not like people uh, they glamorize it a lot I'm sure you would see it as well yeah with like K-pop music itself I, I would I would challenge anyone like you can probably name five house DJs no problem name five South African hip-hop artists for me without artists. having to think about it no, but name five easy, easy. name like five national give me national five national in South uh, Africa uh, I, 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 name five that are like la- name five that are on an AKA level name five 
Okay, we can't. Let's not. Okay, but I mean, there's this Casper, there's Nasty C, but you have to think about that shit though. Like, you could name like DJ Ken, Black Coffee. You could name them without even having to think about house DJs. Okay, I understand your point. You know what I'm trying to say? I understand your point because AK and Ricky, they were not gatekeepers. Yeah. Once you you were popping wherever internet or you have the big song, they were gonna be part of that, regardless. Then you know you're in. Just like in US. Back in a the Drake day, feature yeah, Drake or Nicki yeah. or Weezy gets you in. Mm-hmm. Now, our OGs are gatekeeping us. <laughs> mm-hmm. yeah. yeah, our OGs are gatekeeping us. You get some OGs working at a, a hip-hop radio station, but never plays any local artist. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I, I, there, there's, like, affiliates I work with, they just drop, like, dope mixtapes. Yeah. None of them are getting plays. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. None of them are getting interviews. Mm-hmm. That's why I was talking I about getting shows at local festivals and shit. Yeah. See, yeah. it's just there. That's what I said. Movement, because hip hop is a battle of egos. Mm. At yeah. the end of the day, mm. sure. Ne? If my ego and yours clashes, then it clashes. We won't work. Fine. But yeah. if our spirits align, we're gonna work, mm. regardless yeah. of money or not. Mm. If you want money, I can say no. I have this decent amount, mm. but we can split shit. Yeah. Hence, I yeah. said registration, because now we make a hit song, radio. Sam pays us out. We both benefit. Mm-hmm. You see, 100%, yeah. that's the first thing we have to look at. Mm. I'm not saying unity anymore because mm. I've been preaching unity, but yeah. now the guys, it's that battle of egos. Mm. So let's just work mm-hmm. and then get the support from the other people that are making events or even make our own events if we can. Yeah, yeah, because yeah. it's the same events in PE. Mm. If we are all here, like GOM DJs, you're making an event in March, we're playing. Mm. Next month he's making an event. We playing. Mm. It's the, the other month people, I'm. Yeah. Pl- it's, it's the same yeah. lineup, same, same thing, yeah. just a different <laughs> picture. Like a situation. Yeah. Yeah. It's just yeah. like a stock fair. You're gonna circle. You're gonna play at every event within that yeah. circle. Type yeah. Thing. See okay, now. See you. Okay, now I understand they're not into hip hop, but mm. in order to help the whole movement of Kabeha industry, because mm. look at your DBNs, your CPTs, your Joburg. You have a gom and a piano and a rapper working together mm. because yeah. they're trying to uplift their province. With mm. us, how about maybe one person that's gonna make a, a major event? Just create two two rap artists that just dropped something dope. Yeah. Just be on the lineup. No need to be a headliner. Make them perform it at nine mm. when people are still drinking and they can listen to that. Mm. Yeah, mm. just background motiv- music. Yeah, mm. you're motivating yeah. us yeah. at the end of the day. Yeah. So that's where we lack. I'll think. tell you something fucked up that happened. Mm. So um. So Spl- Splash Festival wasn't too long ago, yeah. Right? Yeah. and I I went on the Saturday, and we went on the Saturday and on the Sunday because Splash is over Easter weekend. But Saturday we went because Chazy had a a Battle Beast dance exhibition thing. But mm. it was like he gets people from the crowd to come and dance. But sure. it's like yeah. it's to promote that like there's a bigger event happening. Yeah. Right. And he like let people know this thing was like circulating on Facebook and Instagram and things for like. Weeks, like mm. two, three yeah, weeks yeah. before, prior the event, yeah, yeah, before the Splash Festival, and we went through, and I, I mean, it's it's basically, it's actually just affirming what Jidav just said. Mm. It's crazy. So, Splash has three stages, sure. like performance stages, yeah. right? They've got the main big stage, they got the indoor stage where the they main do. Big stage is the headliners. Yeah, 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 it's like the J yeah, something, yeah, like J yeah, something yeah, performing on the head stage. Yeah. Uh, Emo Adams performing on the big stage. Mm. Uh, things like that, mm. and then they have another smaller stage that's not far from the um, like where the rides were, like mm. the little playland setup. Mm. The and this one, if I I, I wasn't I was gonna say it, but I thought you know what? it's my place. Mm. I I'm not involved with this. I'm not affiliated with it. Yeah. I'm just here to enjoy the entertainment. So I'm gonna I'm gonna watch. Yeah. And this lady came, and it was all in support of what Chizzy was doing because I mean I go every year, even if I don't have anything to do with whatever, I just go. Mm. For the sake of saying yeah, that I was there, yeah, 100%. dog, this she could have been. It was like a you could see she's somebody's mom, but mm. she's like a we call them you know most we call them yeah, a big auntie. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, she's auntie, she's sure. she's like what she's forty plus. Mm. She sat down like there's like you know those tables and benches where it's like all built together. So we were sitting on the one side and she was sitting a- across the table right, on the right. other side. Yeah. This auntie sat down and she was like, you know these people at Splash Festival are, are so fucked up. How could you take this event, this initiative that this guy's trying to do to help these kids like stay out of trouble and keep them like active and, mm. and you put them in the corner? Mm. There was a rapper that was there before the thing happened. We came yeah. to watch. I don't think anybody even knew he was performing because like, they probably couldn't find where he was mm. because that small stage was like literally shoved on the side. Mm. 
And it's like if you weren't told exactly where to go, to go, you wouldn't have found it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You wouldn't have found that stage. Part, they just want to take a picture of him, post it. Yeah, yeah. but I wanted to go and watch him. Yeah, yeah. yeah. and you didn't even know where to find him. Because yeah. we we got to splash early, to just like walk around and see where everything is. So like we know, okay, the food is there, the yeah. toilets are there, that's there. And we walked and we circled the place like twice. And we were like, where the hell is the stage? We can't find it. Eventually, like behind this empty tent with like others, I feel like, what's going on back there? And we walked and we're like, oh, yes. here it is. <laughs> Damn. In the little corner here where nobody gives a fuck, like the toilets are over there. Like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Stage. That's, wh- that's yeah, what yeah. happened. Yeah. So and it's that's like. That's also kind of just to, okay, let's not put the, the uh, what's the name, the municipality on blast. Yeah. 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 No, we're not. But, but at the same time, I would more and say. They this shit. Yeah. But it's I would like, say this probably. Give them more of a platform somewhere. Like, this is like legitimate, bro. Like, these are people from the city. Exactly. Respect obviously to understand the main stage brings in the money maybe whatever the no, case may be mm-hmm. but I mean these are people that love you my bro that yeah. need to get exposure here yeah. you exactly. understand what I'm saying exactly. so that doesn't make sense no, no it doesn't disrespect it, anything bro. to the municipality yeah. because they probably just fund everything but there is somebody who is called the an organized. events coordinator yeah. The who fund. decides the one who that gets the funds <laughs> that motherfucker <laughs> see the one that gets the funds you be like yeah, yeah, yeah I'm on my cousin is a teacher he decides <laughs> he decides where <laughs> I'm gonna buy me a Bima with this man but it's like he decides where so he gets given yeah. a map of like the place where everything's gonna be and, and like he has that, to yeah. be like okay cool we're gonna put the food court there we're gonna put that there we're gonna put that there that there that there, that there. Mm. so like at least put them in a place where People could at least yeah. walk past them mm. yeah. and be like, oh, it's I like, want to see this. Like that stage like you know what I'm saying? Basically. Exactly. Yeah. It's like an afterthought. Okay, let's, exactly. let's just put it here. And that was what that lady was trying to say. She yeah. was like, this is literally just looks like, you know, yeah. there was an empty space yeah, here in this little just, back. Like, God, and that's where they put the everyone. Yeah. And you can like, imagine now, as maybe someone who's aspires to perform there. Yeah. I wouldn't it's want demotivating, bro. Yeah. It's demotivating. I didn't, yeah. They sent me that to enter for that last thing. Mm. I didn't feel in that form. I was like, nah, man. Yeah. I know it's not going to be and worth it. And the fact that you even didn't want to fall in the form says a lot about I'm like, demotivated. <laughs> I'm <laughs> demotivated. Yeah. No, you know what I mean? And, and yeah. there's no reason for you and to And that's like, the struggles of becoming like a musician in a city, basically. Like, yeah. Let's just not just hip hop, like per se, but. Yeah. The whole like yeah. whole th- we struggle a lot with just this example alone, bro. And Yo. it's not like you guys are coming through and asking them, look here, we need money for this. Nah. No, you just That's need a platform. Crazy nah. about it. You just need a platform. That's all you need. Yeah. And they have the platform, but it's like you have to yeah. f- almost fight. Hey, so now what? you can imagine now you you have to be like a musician. Okay, let's say you can have to be a rapper. Mm, you have to manage. Uh, you manage your own stuff. You have to go to all these places <laughs> and have to sort out this stage stuff. Yeah. You don't even you doing this alone. Yeah, so yeah, alone doing this I by know, yeah. so much demotive. Yeah. You won't have the energy to carry on. <laughs> so I don't. I, I think I that's that. that we as artists struggle on here in Kiva. Mm-hmm. Like and yeah. we struggle a lot with just those micro. It's yeah. like micro, but. When you look at the bigger picture, it's like like a huge It's really big. Yeah. Yeah. The picture's so really yeah, big. Yeah. Yeah. And I, I want to speak to you actually and see about something off here, but I want to ask you guys. So um, being an artist in PE, yeah. is there, are there like managers here? Like people that strictly want to manage. Do you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, that's another point. Mm-hmm. I only knew of one guy that was managing about five guys. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Plus he's also doing his other, I forgot his name. I think it's Vui or something. Mm-hmm. So it was like Birdman. Nah, <laughs> man. <laughs> yeah, like he the whole young money. Being an aspiring man. He was the top of the pyramid and he was like, you know. <laughs> no, there's hunt. someone that runs that, 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 that <laughs> runs the label. He was oh, he was, oh. Yeah, he okay, was just okay, okay. managing. Mm. Okay. Like finding gigs for the guys. And you see the, the guys get like those government gigs because we're talking yeah, about yeah. at Santa. Mm. You see him. Uh, Bunny, Corporate bunny. activations and yeah, shit. he's yeah. performing. The, that's because of that guy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but, but it's better than nothing, though. Yeah, it's yeah. better than so nothing. Yeah. Genuinely better that than he's nothing. Managing five people also says, says a lot. You see, like, yeah. there's no nobody wants to manage people for some reason. Like, why is that? Because I, 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 I don't know if it's like an issue with like. I think it's a lot of admin and stuff. Right? Yeah, yeah, it's, yeah, it's a, a lot. lot. And yeah. uh, if you want to be a manager of someone, you have to be dedicated. Yeah. Trustworthy, because yeah. now you're responsible for this trust guy's trust whole him. career. Because the moment I go to a club to go promote myself, that I wanna perform Saturday, mm. the club owner is already looking down on me. Mm-hmm. But uh, you want to? But if I send my friend wearing a suit, mm-hmm. saying, "Yo, I'm this guy's my nature. He's yeah. got this yeah, hot track. Yeah. 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 Put him on Saturday. In the spot for the yeah. song alone. That's how it's supposed to be. Sick. But unfortunately, we don't have that in PE. Yeah. 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 But what we do have is good music. I won't lie. Yeah. There's cats dropping 
dope nice tracks. Stuff, yeah. Yeah, nice but track. now they lack where they don't drop visuals. Mm, mm, that's mm, something mm. else that's very important because mm. never you can drop in your Spotify and what, but YouTube is there for a reason, yeah. dog. And social media in general. I drop short like, clips of your video. I was I was away most uh, as I told you. Like I took a break. Mm. Then I dropped one song last year. Mm. Was that Doba? No? Yeah, Doba. Mm. Yeah. My first ever drop on YouTube. I got 1,000 views in like five days. Damn. Just five That's days. Crazy. I didn't take that lightly. Damn. Can you speak on the marketing of that? Like, how did you... There was no payment of advertising yeah, or what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just, just, created, dope tech yeah. and people just, I like just it. created a group of five of my friends. I said, five of us are going to post. Yeah, let's just share mm-hmm. this and, and see how it goes. Let's see it. how it goes. Yeah. So that's also a way we like because you need... Promoters for promoters for mm-hmm. now. I'm working on another video now, mm. so I saw that there's a market in doing this. I'm gonna be like Ricky Rick. Mm. See, do, do you see what Ricky did? Single and a hot video mm. every time. He has one album that guy, but mm. he's a legend. Mm. Single and a video. Make sure your video is tight, quality is tight, and mm. the song is dope. That's the only way we're gonna fight for ourselves. Straight, guys. That's the Ricky Rick's policy. Was yeah. straight quality over quantity. Yeah. yeah. So that's the only way we're gonna it. win yeah. if they're gonna block all the doors let's make even more doper music yeah mm. that's the only way i feel like i'm at now i hear it i hear it <laughs> also i don't know a lot of um music video what directors directors or, yeah, yeah. 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 or well, videographers who specialize yeah, yeah. 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 in, yeah. in music we videos we also like that i think in the mu- music scene because i know one off the top of my head right now yeah. but yeah. only because he's been busy with it recently yeah I, I i don't know I, this is interesting to me because like have you collaborated with any colored or white guys besides before daniel before dan before we rocked up the no. before that's the dungeon the days that i that's don't understand, understand. yeah you understand i'm saying like uh, it's all this like this segregation almost maybe bro, between the people because like like you've said now he can think of one person that like directs and right um not direct not writes but like does music videos so to say do you sure. get what i'm saying so it's like if we were to just integrate into each other's worlds my bro yeah do you get what i'm saying that's the movement i'm like, talking like cross about pollinate, yeah. finish because i mean like you said now off the top you can think of one and if we gave it some time you think of a few more mm-hmm. someone has a camera someone someone has this someone does that mm-hmm. edits grades my bro it can come together but it's always the segregation yeah. we all got the brain we just need a few people like anyone that's listening, yeah. just a few people, if you know you're part of the culture, whether you're a videographer, whether you're doing vlogs, or you're, you're a promoter, graphic. or you're a graphic, graphic designer, designer, let's all link up. Mm. Let's because make a movement for GQ. I also don't 100%. know one graphic designer. You do, yeah. nigga, you're looking at him. <laughs> hey, <laughs> bro, we don't need anymore, and we have an Asian brand. No, no, I'm, just, I'm just putting yeah, out there. Out, 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 My guy. <laughs> no, I'm okay, joking. Okay. I'm joking. I'm joking. Now we know. Now, now, now. Yo, this guy, okay. he said it's so confident. Now I'm like, no. <laughs> I'm just, yo. Besides Kevin. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I like no, but I get you though. I yeah. get you. Yeah. Because an artist would like yeah. make the music. You also like okay. Let me let me do like a my own album art. Design. Yeah. Album yeah. art goes to EP Kevin cover. Picks, <laughs> picks and, art. Oh. and you can see Ooh. the, the qualities. When that bad. happens, yeah. you can yeah. see the qualities. That's why I'm saying like we need professionals for the like the yeah, you need And they must know hip hop is the one of the hardest genres out there, dog. Mm. Hip hop is from the US. In, in South Africa, we made it good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. See, I'm a pianist from us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, we can claim yeah. that with the full chest. Yeah. In the yeah. US, they're trying to do it. Mm, yeah. Yeah, we actually spoke about that on the pod one day, see, but when T.I. made it, because when T.I. made it, I'm a piano Don't be surprised right. if Drake does him a piano track. Yeah, I mean, the there were a few where he was reaching for it. Don't be surprised. There were a few where he was reaching for it. He was like, ah, not yet. Jamaican sound. Yeah. Yeah. You know, yeah. Yeah. My Someone piano, and then piano. we're gonna get our OGs doing on my piano. Yeah. 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 But yeah, shout yeah, out to Kuli Chan. Yeah, and and AKA, yeah. AKA did try to incorporate my piano sounds mm-hmm. in like his Even last like album. The yeah, stuff. those yeah. long drums. Yeah. yeah. That's the only way we're gonna win. Because mm-hmm. we see my piano is dominating. Okay, let's steal this 808. Because yeah. it resembles my piano. Yeah. And everyone I know exactly what he wants to do. Because it's Lemonade. When I heard that song, I was like, and it's yeah. our sound. And it's our sound. You can yeah. claim that. And then you can, you can that, yeah. infuse your own style with that. Yeah. There's a lot of ideas. And you know what? It's funny that you guys are saying it now because Idol just mentioned it now. And and that's a colored guy. Yeah. That's a brown man. Yeah. yeah. That did that. That did that. Yeah, it's a brown man that did that. 
So it's Robert. like he literally took the culture from from South, South Africa ah, he's and threw it all South into ah. one pot. Yeah. He's like, let's go. Let's, let's yeah. I'll never change. Get. I'll yeah. stay it, South Africa. And is, to this day is still a, a, a spectacular That's a song. Yeah. Yeah. That's and a classic. Funny. It's going to be a classic. Because I wanted to talk to you about this and just the idea of like, because I saw someone said once that like people that do hip hop now, the owns they don't want to do hip hop anymore because there's just no support. So they yeah. move to Mabia no and yeah. 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 What's trending? Owens in Cape Town are doing drill now in Afrikaans because yeah, that's yeah. now booming drill music specifically. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So I want to ask you like how do you feel about um because I, I know we spoke about it a bit now, but it's like would you rather incorporate incorporate little sounds and little elements into hip hop instead of like moving from making yes, like changing your entire yeah. lane yeah. Yeah. So now piano, some uh, drill or uh, uh, so let me tell you about Chido. I grew up under Kwaito music. Mm. Oh. I'm purely South Ah with my sound. Even if I have to sample something, <laughs> I'm gonna sample a South I'm African song. Mm. Yeah, well, no. mm. I grew up like that. Oh. My next upcoming single is a drill song, mm. but we drilling in chorus. Oh, what? You yeah. see, we changed it. We drilled in chorus. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's coming out featuring my boy Dizikai One. <laughs> no, no, uh, one of the guess. hottest niggas I coming up. Yeah, yeah, he strictly raps in chorus. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, yeah, mm. Dizzy. Yeah. yeah, I'm shooting a video probably next week. I want to drop the song and the visual same day. Oh, yeah. That's, oh, what yeah, it, that's, that's the pressure I want to put on the guys. Yeah. About every song I'm going to drop as a single, even if I have 10 tracks as an EP, but mm. drop a song and a video. Mm-hmm. Maybe three months later, song and a video. Yeah. Because the reason I decided to drop on YouTube only was because I have hardcore fans, which I call Cheeto mates, mm. since I'm Cheeto. Most of those people from my hood, they don't have phones to go on Spotify. Mm. They don't have iTunes and all that stuff. Yeah. But there's so only one place they can yeah. go to, and YouTube. YouTube yeah. So you make it more accessible for yeah. them. You see? So 100% makes sense. Anyone can go on YouTube. Yeah, literally, yeah, yeah. Yeah, makes complete sense. Found the, 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 the platform that everybody ha- that he needs to reach has. Everyone can go there. Yeah. So I just, I just cracked that system. Mm. And I don't That's mad clever, bro. <laughs> That's a shit. Yeah. See, yeah. damn. And I, That's I don't a loophole for your ass. <laughs> That's, That's a loophole. Yes, he's been like under the game because. See, yeah. studying the game. Because okay, how am I trying, gonna do yeah. this? How am I gonna do this? And yeah. that's, that's not even we're not. That's not just hip hop. That's a marketing standpoint. That's marketing See? brain. Yeah. Because you need to figure out, bro, your audience and how they access and you how to yeah. show. Because yeah. now we we behind that sending everyone on WhatsApp. Please like my share my no no. Not everyone's gonna post that, yeah. but if they see quality and they see a snippet of a good song, they're gonna share it. Cause, yeah, because yo, yeah. this is quality. Yeah. Yeah. That's why we sharing all Usimamani and all those big guys. Cause you just share the first fifteen minutes of the song, like, hey, this is dope. Let me it share. Bangs. Let yeah. me go listen to it. Yeah, finish, bro. Let's so it's it. good music only and a good team, good movement, trustworthy guys. That's it. Mm. He's yeah. gonna be mm. backstabbers at the end of the day. Yeah. But Check I trust this Judas's. guy. Yeah. <laughs> and there's there's <laughs> always a two like General setbacks maybe yeah. happens, yeah. but like yeah. it's to push through. It's all to of that push diversity, through. Bro. Like what was happening before yeah. we set up. Yeah. Yeah. But we made sure we're you gonna need, set you up. Made a plan, bro. Yeah. And we continued uh, we, uh, on a different day. We might have said, hey, let's run. If it was the OG3 meme and Steve's women were like, yeah, guys, we're just not in the cards to film. <laughs> we're like, nah, we made Jido come all this way. We can't <laughs> <laughs> Jido Taba come all this way for no reason, guys. So we made it work. But yeah, it actually yeah. did work out, man. So, um, yeah, man. What I want to, what, what I, well, um, so I, sh- I wouldn't say, it's, I, okay, I know from, for myself, like, when, um, when it comes to, to the art that I do, because I'm, I'm a, an illustrator and a graphic designer, and mm-hmm. I also draw on paper and shit, but like, one of the things that I noticed when I was trying to get, besides obviously the hard work, that um, it takes to besides you know the besides the gatekeepers and sure, the, uh, sure, besides sure, them, sure. what what are the challenges did you face? Like because with me it was trying to be better than I was the last time. Because like you, I I have this one homie, shout out Flicky, Clint Flamer. He's an insane illustration artist, right? Mm-hmm. And I would always send him things because mm-hmm. we went to high school together. But he's older than yeah, you. Yeah, sure. Yeah. And I saw this dude draw a couple of times, and I was like, damn. One day when I'm big, I'm yeah, gonna draw yeah, like this yeah, guy. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, One day when I'm big, I wanna draw like this guy. Yeah. And it got to a point where like, you know what, I was like, I was confident enough, I was like, you know, I, I see him as like a big homie. Sure. So I'm gonna just send him my stuff and then whenever I do another one, I'm gonna send it to him. Just I'm just gonna keep sending it to him. Yeah, just and then the, and and that besides, you know, like the whole breaking into the industry if you wanna call it that. Yeah. That was one of my biggest challenges was like, how do I get better at doing it? And then it got to a point where he like I would send him something and then I would like 
not be busy and I'd be doing other stuff like I'd be doing logos and other sh- and then I'd do another drawing and send it back and then his response was like damn I can see yeah. you getting better yeah, at this yeah he sees the progress yeah. yeah so what was like that kind of challenges for you because I mean music obviously like you, you have to evolve like even if you listen to like Nasty C's old songs like his Bad Hair yeah, album yeah, compared yeah. to like his yeah, new stuff yeah. even the, the the Bad Hair album compared to the song that he made with ASAP Ferg it's a massive like transition mm. like between those yeah. two yeah like if you listen to Hell Now compared to um, yeah. King, yeah, mm. it's like it's like two it's different, different people. Different so what, what, like for the two of you, I know that you're a producer and yeah. I know that you're a rapper. Like, what kind of challenges did you have to overcome with like getting your music from where it was your pain game to like to then now? Then. Yeah, yeah. Like what I because I I mean to, to, I don't know anything about music, so to me yeah. like I don't know sure, what the sure, trials sure. and tribulations would be. And we all have our different stories. Yeah, yeah. Like with me. It's mentality sure, first. Okay. It starts yeah. with my mentality. Yeah, 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 yeah. As a rapper, when you're a rapper, people think it's light. It's not light because you put yourself in 20 people's shoes because mm. sometimes you're writing stories. Mm-hmm. You're not writing about yourself. Mm. You're just writing on reference stories that you grew yeah. up under. Some different perspective, yeah, see? maybe. And then, yeah. fortunately for me, the break I took was to like perfect my craft Oh, what sound? Sa- what sound do I want? You, you really do I want? want? And you yeah. Yeah. make See? sure that's your sound, yeah. no. so yeah. that you can hear about ah, this is Cheeto, mm. mm. this is Cheeto. Yeah, bo. It was that first, and then my other producer left for good PTA, which I was working closely with. Mm. So that's also a set my like a yeah. setback. Set mm. yeah. Then the sabotages that you get from nowhere. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not talking about gatekeeping and whatever, because. Yeah. Yeah. Just to run it back, 2015, I had a song called Aslal. Yeah, well, that song was one of the biggest songs yeah, in PE. I would say that in yeah, well. the streets, maybe went gold. In the streets, yeah, well. I'm not in the saying streets, like yeah. 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 In the streets, you went gold. In the streets, you won three grams. That time, that time we're dropping on Data File. Yeah. For oh, damn. Yeah. Yeah. That time. The homies had to go download the game. Now imagine the amount of downloads I got was like 8 point something K. That's wild, my bro. Damn, Just bro. shot a video. Mm. The guy shot a video and said it crashed. Oh, snap. That shit killed me mentally because mm. I was close. Yeah. Yeah. I was still a young kid and I have OGs I look up to, your Ace Maddox, your Mises, your what, and they're grooming me up. Mm. And then I just get sabotaged like that, no video. Mm. And then that shit started fucking me up. Then I moved to Josie. That's when I was starting like to research know more about myself it's yeah. all about finding yourself because yeah, we watch we watch these interviews of rappers saying be yourself stay true to being yourself and we're like what are you talking about and then i realized but i'm my that guy's is yeah. really being honest mm-hmm. be you mm-hmm. like this true song i'm me there you yeah. won't hear me sounding like dave like in the big city day mm-hmm. no it's me but it's a true song mm-hmm. yeah, yeah. yeah yeah so that's uh, the that, that um, you. Um, with me, um, I think it's all in, in the head, mm. as he said. Um, it's mentally like trying to evolve. Yeah. Yeah, trying to, okay, you know you, you're making this type of sound. Mm. How can you evolve a sound? Yeah. How can you, I know your, your ADOs um, are banging in a certain way. How can you now mm. find a, a way, like mm. a, a little thing yeah. to, to, to make you. I think also like your market is so saturated, like everybody thinks they're a producer, everybody's yeah. a producer. You so have to stand out yeah, from yeah. that. Yeah. Have to, yeah. you have, people have to kind of recognize you from like a certain sound. Mm-hmm. I had to like the, for the longest time kind of figure out what type of sound I, uh, mm-hmm. I want to do. I would, I would dip into this, I would dip into that. But one thing that would like be like in common, there mm. was a certain sound, uh, I would say emotional, mm. emotional sound, like melody. Oh, crazy, yeah, yeah. Whether it's a drill, whether it's hip hop or gum, whatever, there will be like some sort of element in the song that I know That's that emotional. Mm. I can't, I can't like yeah. go out, outside of this sound. Mm. Maybe this is how I should make my sound, mm. basically. So that's that was um, finding that. So like eight words and violence. Yeah, 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 violence. Yeah, like, oh, yeah. yeah. See, when we talk about trap, bah. he's a solified trap. Okay. Even when he hooks me on to this artist, I'm like, I don't know what it is, is man. <laughs> I, I, I would try to make like a certain sound, but within making that sound, there will be something distinctive yeah. to what I've been always doing. Okay, okay, yeah, okay. That's like what you're calling God. Something yeah. that you, that you yeah. found, that you figured out afterwards, like, oh, this is something that you noticed. But it's, it's always, always in my beat. Yeah, there's always something beat. similar that oh, I kind yeah. of do. Yeah. That's, that's, the, that's yeah. what I, I kind of found out. Okay, let me, let me not 
mm-hmm. try to do like a lot of stuff. Mm-hmm. Let me not yeah. okay. For let me make an example. I'm making a drill song. Right. Drill sounds the same way in terms of like the hats, the mm-hmm. the drums or club jersey or mm-hmm. whatever. Mm-hmm. But I would have a, a certain sound or melody mm-hmm. in the beat where I would say. I can't shake it off. It'll <laughs> always be yeah. some sound. Yeah. Maybe yeah. I was supposed to make this like this. Yeah. Like maybe, maybe I was supposed to care out with the sound. That was the one thing that I was struggling with. Mm. Which when I, I find it out, and you maybe hearing maybe in this upcoming um 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 tape, okay. with all the songs that I produce, because right. he worked with a lot of producers. All right. With my beats, mm. there's always like the, you, even you, when you he sounds yeah. in the beats, mm. I'm like, bro, why are you always emotional? Because you're giving me that vibe, <laughs> why bro. Why are you always emotional in the beats that I make? Why is, why are you always like? Yeah, yeah. Okay, you can't be gangster, but yeah. there will be emotional yeah. side yeah. of the, uh, the what you're gonna say mm-hmm. in the beat. So mm-hmm. that's why I said. That's how I kind of figured out my sound, okay. Hey, bro, I'm going to listen to that thing now. And, and to answer <laughs> just uh, lastly what you asked, we come from a hood that is very stereotyped. Mm. Mm. Even though it is too gangster, mm. we come from your bright team. Even if you see, you just said, yo. You just said, yo. You see, even if you ask a girl out, they ask you, you stay in your bright team. I sort of put, we out. Miss me. So now... I'm all about motivation. Yeah. Yeah. All the songs we're going to listen to, I'm always motivating. Whether I'm mod- motivating someone older, a young kid, or whoever, I'm mm. always motivating. We are no, not all of us are born for crime, fit. Yeah, yeah. Crime, we, we, when we were born, crime was here. Yeah. Yeah. But not all of us you are born for that shit. You see? He's an officer. He's an officer. He's an officer. You see what I'm saying? Because <laughs> I was going to my dealer now, now. I saw two young kids chilling there. I'm rocking my airports there, and then one dies, you know, most mm. batteries low. Mm. Then this boy is calling me, hey, good man. I'm like, yeah, yeah, show off it. Yeah, good man, you inspire me. Oh, crazy. See, I have a studio, I don't have a mic, good man. As soon as I buy a mic, I'd like you in my studio, good man. You mm. really inspire me. Looking at that boy, he was smoking thick. They Damn. took him to rehab. Now he's back. Mm. He just wants to do something else. And I felt more inspired by, hey, man, this boy... You, you look at me and you see inspiration. Yeah. Mm. So that's what I want to do, Gagatim. I want to inspire. Mm. Yeah, boy. I hear it. I hear it. Let's change the narrative. But I of my, hey, man, if I need money, I must do crime. There's mm. a lot of things we can do, guys. Yeah. yeah. So going back to your, your question, I would yeah. say the biggest challenge is finding your, your sound. Mm. Because you know, there will be a time, for instance, we've been like making music for like past 12 years. Mm. What sounded... Um, in 2012 doesn't sound the same now. Mm. No. Oh, so, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I guess it's, it's a very good song. So, yeah. Yeah. If, if you were, like, maybe part of the game, you were, your, your songs are out there, also for you, maybe, you kind of have a sense of, I was doing what was being done in 2012, mm. then 2014 happened, then there was maybe trap, and, and then you did trap, mm. then 20-whatever drill happened, the then you did drill, yeah. then you, you yeah. kind of get me, but for me, was all those years there was always one distinctive sound that I'd always like mm-hmm. the Go middle back. ground that yeah. they would go into. Mm. So that's why I, I I was struggling with like finding that middle ground where okay, I'll say okay, mm. whatever genre, whatever You're sound I'm trying to it. Yeah. This this is yeah. the main yeah. like if you someone from the outside you know that okay, this beat was made like by me because mm. you can hear the elements of my sound so yeah. that was my Amazing. struggle basically yeah. like i had to find that sound and stick to it yeah and keep yeah. it with yeah. whatever type of music you yeah want you like. make yeah. yeah other than that uh the struggles is just getting pure luck man yeah. <laughs> just make yeah. it like a seven yeah. Yeah. Now and yeah. Again. Yeah. no one's gonna yeah. come like fall from the no sky and drop like seven like bands this. and yeah. say yeah. hey bro I have like this and this money. I want you to be the face of whatever. Let's go. Yeah. Even it's if that's yeah. our dream, like, yeah. you know, like in the <laughs> lamb, yo, 20 m yeah. nigga, do your thing. <laughs> like, so oh, now with everything we do, bro. we have to kind of have have the sacrifice. Okay, mm. for instance, I'm making a song. I would probably need uh, a graphic designer. Mm. I have to hit you up, but I can't go and say, Kev, you like my homie. Yeah. And stuff like you yeah, we all have to eat. Yeah. Like, can you start do, this shit can professionally? You, can, you, can, you, can you do something for me? Mm. 
also for you, you probably do something for me, but it will be on the sense of I'm just doing something for him. It's not mm. in a professional level because yeah. I didn't even come in a professional manner yeah. with you. But to your point, I think there's also like this whole thing of like, bruh, we a lot of us are on the camera. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. let's maybe like, you might need a beat at some yeah, point yeah. in time. So, yeah. you know, throw something for me. Wash my yeah. hand now so I can wash those legs. Yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah, there's yeah. none of that also. Everybody think they deserve it. Now, rappers yeah. don't have that mentality. Yeah. yeah. He's booming now. You're like, yo, bro, I'd like you on a song. And then he's going to tell you, 1.5. Hey, yeah. dog, it's the 13th of the month. I don't have 1.5. Yeah. 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 But what if we make this song and it's fine, then you like it. Mm. Now everything is changing. Because yeah. you like the song now. And then what do I do? I pay you 1.5. I'm not giving you royalties. Mm. If you make a hit. Yeah. See, that was your initial request. Yeah, well, yeah. It's all about the bigger picture at the end of the day. Mm. I hear it. It's yeah. all about the bigger picture. It's a, it sounds like there's a lot of backstabbery. In, uh, Yo, it's yeah. a lot, bro. We, 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 we had a band on. Shout out to the guys from Boiling Point. What's up, guys? We want you to come back, but we had a we had a band. Remember, I told you when we had like eight dudes. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah, yeah. We had like <laughs> the, stage, the studio was flooded. That was like six section, huh? yeah, six, yeah, yeah. like three, three. Yeah, me and Steve were in the middle, and um, they were they were speaking about the music industry as well and like the things that they face and the it's things that they go through. World tool in the hip hop side. Yeah, yeah, no, they like a Obviously hardcore the, rock band, know, the, the but they mad music. cool. They like the friendliest guys you'll yeah, ever yeah, meet. Yeah, they're the friendliest dudes. Because we also crazy. Yeah, they they really dope. And then one of the things they were saying the most is that like especially in the scene in PE, um, because the market is so like, well, not the market, but like because of the, their world also being so kind of backstab-ish, mm. like mm. you'll find like the, 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 the lead guitarist oh, of their yeah. band yeah. Sure. is in three other bands. Oh, no. So shit. he's in Boiling Point and he's in that band and that uh, band, but like whoever books him for the gig yeah, first yeah. gets he him first. Yeah. Yeah. Now the other band is short. Now they're short oh, the guitarist yeah, or whatever yeah, the case yeah. is. Like yeah. Something along the lines of yeah. that, yeah. It's also a money thing, I think. They yeah. said. It's, more, yeah. it's, be, it's a better way to get your money together most yeah. because mm. obviously the gigs don't pay much. So if you were drum in three different bands, one of them gets booked and then there's yeah. some bank that comes Honestly, that. Yeah. Yeah. So you're always, you're always busy. And all this stuff. Exactly. But like, yeah, yeah, yeah. So like, uh, I've, I've noticed that, um, especially, wouldn't say recently. I've noticed for a while, in my opinion. Mm. But the music scene in general, not just like with, with uh, hip-hop and general, rap. Yeah. In general, as a, as a whole, it is kind of like, it's you gotta like, you literally gotta take scary, one eye out and like to the back that's of that's your head. Yeah. You gotta take to the back of your head, bruh, because it's a, it is a bit. But and also the dancing stuff too. Was all, I, I wasn't yeah. like a, I wasn't a like a professional dancer, but I, I grew up doing it. And I stopped like after all because like ah, I'm not feeling this anymore. Yeah. But like I still like went to the events sure, and I still sure, hung out sure, with the sure. guys. Yeah. There's still all my friends. Supporting yeah. the, couch, uh, yeah. the, the The guy who taught me basically everything I know was on the podcast a couple of episodes ago. But like I noticed like with that alone how snaky mm-hmm. like. The industry, the, the art industry, the art yeah. industry as a say, whole yeah. can be because um, of the way they would change um, members. Yeah. Like the, there'll be like, th- let's say there'll be three popular crews at a time. Mm. And then the one, like crew A will lose a member to crew B. Mm. Who will lose ah, a member to crew C. Who will lose a member to crew B. Oh, and, was like, and then yeah. they're like, they're beefing because, yeah, but you took yeah. our lead yeah. dancer yeah. for the, but you know that they know, they're known for this, da, 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 whatever. Yeah. And it got to a point where like, I'll rem- I remember this one time they had, um, you know where Fruit and Veg used to be in Newton Park? Mm. It's a Midas yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Above there, there's a there's a karate dojo now. It's like oh, a South Fins dojo, but yeah. it used to be a dance studio run by Deja Vu and they w- went to a gig there. It could have been like 2012. Mm. And the beef f- from the crews got yeah. so bad that the crew members' parents were getting involved. And like the moms were like, all like staying each other down and like, they they were like, yo, I was about to be some stomp the yard with the moms and I was like, you know what I'm saying? And I was like, and the the thing is now, okay, fine, fair enough, the competition that they ended, yeah, there was money on the line, blah, blah, whatever, fair enough. But I'm not going to get involved in some kids' politics Mm. if we're not talking like Mad racks, like yeah, y'all exactly figure this out. Let the floor settle it for you. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. Let the floor settle it for you. Whoever wins, wins. Whoever lost, lost. You uh, need to take your Allen. Come back. Yeah, yeah. Come back. Come back but next even year. To Jiro's point, bro, yeah. I feel like there's no. The, to a certain extent, we don't have to be best friends when yeah. we do this shit. No, we don't. Yeah. There can be an element of like we're just exchanging music or we're exchanging a verse or yeah. you know what I mean? Like nothing has to be like oh you backstab because we're brothers and stuff. Yeah. 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 If there's a money situation involved, that's what it is. We don't have to make it anything more than yeah, that. Do you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. That's what I also don't understand. Mm. Like, it doesn't have to run that deep where it's like, yo, 
Nah, you're stabbing me in the back now because, you know, we've been making music, three albums together, whatever the case, yeah. but it's yeah. not. Yeah. Man, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, there's no business aspect to it in PE, basically. No. Yeah. There's no economy for, like, yeah. actual economy. Yeah. Right, I'm going to, I'm going to, to, like, literally make the point, to exclaim the point that you just made. But that was part of the Neptunes for a long ass time. And then when he called them back to make an album and they ma- called, the, like, called the band Nerd, yeah. nobody was feeling salty. They were like, yeah, let's go. <laughs> they just <laughs> continued like yeah, nothing yeah, ever happened. Yeah. Nothing happened. <laughs> Pharrell made two solo albums and then went back to Nerd mm. and then made another solo yeah, album yeah, and then yeah. came back to Nerd again oh, yeah. and nobody felt it's anything. All in the paper. Nobody was upset. It's all in the yeah. paper. And every no. album was dope. Like yeah. all the music that came out, like y'all were singing happy and clapping yeah, and shit yeah. when Pharrell was doing <laughs> the thing yeah. by himself. And then when he came back and was back with Nerd, yeah. y'all were singing along to it too. Oh, like, yeah. And they were like going on, co- like on tours and shit. Yeah. Everything was fine. Mm-hmm. But it's like, I feel like, I'm sure Jiro will feel the same way. I feel like when people make a decision to either to do something for themselves, but you used to be part of a collective, they take yeah. it personal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They yeah, take yeah. it personal. It's like, oh, so now you don't fuck with me anymore. Mm. Like, but, but it's like, no, bro, I just, I need to do this for me. Yeah. <laughs> it's and not it's about like, you. It's like and yeah, yeah, yeah but it's not of, about you. There's yeah. a lot of GQ rappers that are dealing with that right now. They yeah. in crews, they fell out, now they... Fuck you, fuck you. But yeah. they're beefing with, with, with each, each other, other for yeah. no reason. No. <laughs> for no yeah. reason. Yeah. Yeah. When you get down to the crux of it, it's like, we're not really fighting over anything. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Just like Rayquan and Ghostface Ghost Killer, yeah. Wu Tang. Oh, yeah. Wu Tang. Same mm-hmm. shit. Yeah. yeah. They were beefing. Mm. Ended up being on the same yeah. clique. Yeah. Yeah. Ended up being like close. Like and when they asked, what are they stuff. beefing for? Mm. They, they didn't have an answer. Rayquan shot it like Ghostface Killer's house. Now the uh, niggas asking, why did you shoot in my house? Nigga, I don't know. I was just shooting because of the idea. Yeah. What the fuck is that? <laughs> the idea that yeah. <laughs> yeah. there was a beef. There was actually nothing in actuality. Yeah. That's hilarious, bro. But yeah, but man. It is bonkers, actually, if you think about it. Uh, it's <laughs> tough. It's tough in there. That's why I said there's no industry in PE. Because if we could all just unite. Because first of all, we don't have a place for hip hop in PE. Yeah. Mm. A designated club or wherever spot like mm-hmm. Gondwana was mm-hmm. for hip hop in people. Like the young stage. Yeah, yeah, we don't have that. Yeah. If we could have that maybe every last Friday mm. there's a hip hop thingy. Wherever. Yeah. Just call mm. someone that recently dropped maybe like four rappers mm. and two DJs. Then we start the culture slowly. Yeah. slowly you yeah. guys are there maybe you're not doing a podcast maybe interviews. Yeah. yeah you see mm-hmm. yeah, well, each and every you're involving like, every yeah. aspect of, of the, the culture. Media, yeah. yeah. Yeah, if we, if we could start like that, yeah. I'm gonna go that, somewhere. What you said earlier about like, bro, these these owns have these radio stations. They're on twenty four seven. You're telling me you can't give the come up artists an hour slot, maybe play some of the songs, maybe do an interview. Oh, I no. wouldn't like. I understand. Like, let's say for example, I don't know, four to six. That's like rush hour. Okay, that's rush that's hour. Your money. I feel like I, I gotta say something because if I don't, I'm I'm gonna feel like a very bad friend if I do, <laughs> if I don't say something. No, 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 no. I gotta put some respect on my friend's name quickly mm. because if I don't, I'm I'm gonna feel like a bad friend. I need to shout out to Rosh Lay Bloom on our yeah. Go FM because she actually did that shit. She there was a time when yeah, she was true. doing it. Yeah. So, ma, you did do it. Like and I've, I've even referred. I've, re- I've even referred. So I've I referred Dan. Mm. I referred Dull. Mm. Um, and there were a couple other people. Why I was like, yo, get a hold of Rosh Lay because yeah. she's actually asking mm. for local yeah, people yeah, 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 to yeah. send their music to her, mm. and she will play it on the radio. And they yeah. were even they even did interviews with her. Mm. So. I know. I, uh, shout out. I'll, shout I'll, out. I'll, 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 you guys can speak shit about everything else, but I actually nah, nah, nah. know no, somebody personally who did it. So I, I have to but put some respect on your name for that. I know, but we need it now. We need to put it back. That's that. They don't have a hip hop slot. Sorry, man. Yeah, they don't. Yeah, they don't have. Cause uh, uh. But it's what you say. There's this older friend of mine. Cause I speak to her. She's like a mentor. I always ask advices. She used to act. Mamu, this doko. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. What's her name for me? Sorry, shit. No, oh my God. <laughs> 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 oh, my word. No lean to. No lean, to. No lean yeah. Yeah, yeah, she was with Mr. Bones. I'll take off your bread knife and cut off your job. Okay. Let me go shoot the shit. Yeah, she was there. So yeah. she used to be my client. So yeah. I used to speak to her. Now she once told me about alcohol that they don't cater for Ilanduk, for hip hop. Mm-hmm. Yeah, she's a cool lady. Now, message for all those. Re- Local stations that do hip hop, consider the young boys, guys. Listen to the like kids. What happened to Metro, dog? Metro was the hip hop station. Payola, they got look. I gotta pay 10k. As soon as DJ Fresh left, shit went south. Payola. 
you don't cut the club. Lucas Rap had a, what you call this, I think some sometime last week, he had a one hour show where he was performing his always Metro. Kid, yeah, Metro. Uh, the store. But he's established. Yeah, he's yeah, established. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you're yeah. talking about like now, come up artists. Come you know, up, like, so Because give him a slot, bro. Like, that's these, not these, the these guys, thing. these local radio stations are even featured by Miss Cosmo. Miss Cosmo takes local artists yeah. from all around all South around, Africa yeah. and makes it top five. Miss mm-hmm. Cosmo, an established mm-hmm. DJ. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So like we need more of those to pop. Like you kind of yeah. have also to have to put in the work of like no, so definitely. Work out there. Like, that's what I'm yeah. talking about. Yeah. Good music, yeah. Yeah. quality yeah. music. Yeah. That's what sells. No, definitely. I mean, you can't just take anyone off the streets and like yeah, hope that they're gonna yeah. make, you're gonna yeah. starve yeah. like you. You got to yeah. see some kind of star quality. Definitely speaking from a perspective of people at work. We talk yeah. about people at work, not just like yeah. you know what I mean. Yeah. Always said sometimes maybe make a song. Yeah. Or like, sure. We need like a type of consistency. Consistency, yeah, kind of is needed. Cause yeah, which is what I was lacking in. Cause mm-hmm. what I was going through. But now I'm fully back. Yeah, fully yeah, yeah, I'm I'm you can even see my hair. I'm super sad. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, I'm still. That time when it was almost hyperbolic time yeah, chamber. Yeah, 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 I mean, I was in the time chamber. In the time chamber, bro. He was gone for four years, but like in reality, he was gone for like twenty. Bro, he was gone for a minute. <laughs> yo, bro, like we felt four years go past. Jida was like, yo, guys, it's only been four. Damn, <laughs> I've been gone it, for a while. <laughs> to put it in a nutshell, the whole industry changed. Um, Meaning, subject matter wise, yeah, we no longer sing about the same shit. Yeah. Mm. And we're not singing about Porsches and Bentleys and watches and mm. chains now. Mm. People are bored of that. Mm. Hence, yeah. I'm a piano is the big thing because now they're telling you to play, go to church. Nah, nah, too, nah. Yeah. It's reminiscing with you. Mm. Yeah. Mm. So it's all about we're what you. on a deeper level. Yeah. yeah. I'm talking about the content of the music. That's interesting. Mm. Like where your music touches. Yeah. Now, yeah. I feel happy now if an uh, old mama likes my song. Mm. Then I know I done my job. Mm. When I did Tober before dropping it, I went to Tober's mom, mm. just to f- just for her to listen to the song. She cried. I didn't know what to do. She was honest with me. She was like, "Look, It's like a dedication song. Yeah, it's a dedication song. Mm. She was like, "Look, Danam, I know my son was a thug, mm. but he never touched anyone in the streets. Mm. He always protected people." I'm just grateful that you made Telling such a, story, a beautiful yeah. song and you told his story. Mm, mm. I was like, ah, it's and my I, thing. Literally, I'm glad you said that also. Explain that because I wanted to ask you about like how you feel about like subject matter and kind of finding that middle ground because obviously rap comes from um, gangsta origins gangsta. of gangsta. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. And of course, we have now the Drakes and these people that aren't, they talk about guns and what they talk about shooting people, but it's not as like there's a, a softer element it's not that. real that's why it's that not that's true. why it's not banging yeah because tupac mm-hmm. told i'm gonna shoot you know you know there's yeah. gonna be shots now a young boy you don't know you can see he can't even handle a gun <laughs> i'm gonna shoot this niggas in the in it. ah come on man okay but now i'm asking you like where do you find the middle ground now between like the gangster rap stuff and like the, like kind of resonating with like you know what i mean like with the sure. younger crowd and kind of making them understand that if you mention a gun it's not really about shooting it it's more about putting it down kind of thing you understand sure. what I'm trying to say? so yeah. yeah the context like yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. how do you get the context yeah. across the content across make it like, relevant yeah make it sound nice mm. like tober oh, i'm singing about a tag there but <laughs> when i perform it everyone is happy hey, I got tober. Mm. when he was a tag mm. you see so it's how you put it, how you like write it, because mm. as a rapper, there's all those things we learned in English, your similes, your yeah, metaphors, your metaphors, and what yeah. what. So it's all about subject matter and the time, guys. Time is rolling. Mm. We're not in the two thousands now. We're into some new stage mm. now. Mm. Your blackies aren't rapping about guns, man. Nah, yeah. yeah. you feel me? 100%. Your nasties aren't rapping about guns. Yeah. We're over that. Yeah. So it's all about that, man. Yeah. Consistency. But if you if you about that, then you're a rapper. Okay, it makes sense. It makes sense. Yeah, yeah. yeah. it makes sense. You are just gonna try not yeah. to promote it. You're yeah. gonna write it in a way that I'm not promoting you to kill. Yeah. But there is the this. reason. The reason I'm asking is because Twenty One's latest album, the man. One song, the man's talking about shooting people. Yeah. Yeah. The next song, he's saying, nah, he wants the, like, the young to put the guns down. So I was like, so, okay, what are we actually doing? What do you really want? Exactly. Because like, when he came up, it was all that gangster yeah. guys. Yeah. Nice but now he's yeah. into he the music industry sonically, like, yeah. he, with more greater musicians. Mm-hmm. So now he wants to cater for everyone. Mm. 
Yeah. It's no longer for a certain target audience. Mm-hmm. It's for everyone. Please. I yeah. also look at it like it's kind of his character, what he went through is like gang life. Yeah. But like he also wants to, like the youngins to understand like it's not really that. It's important. not like, really the be, way. Yeah. yeah. It's not really the way. Yeah. Yeah. Makes sense. Makes sense. Yeah, I so just it's found like that. that. And also yeah. wrapping up our money don't have yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I don't think people actually. <laughs> I, I want to say this about the fact that you guys are asking about like the context and making things relevant. I don't think that people even realize nowadays that like it's so easy for you to get fact checked by people. Not even people that need to know who you are. That's true. Yeah. That's people true. that just hear about you and you're like, oh, Idol's been talking about this. <laughs> what? Then we go Somebody's check. gonna be like. I don't even did that shit in his whole life. Yeah, what is he talking about? Never saw a gun in my life. You know what I'm saying? It doesn't even have to be about a gun. Yeah. Just, it, it could be about anything. anything. Yeah, 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 I know, I know. And they're going to, bro, they'll, they'll find a way to fact check you to yeah. see and whether or not you're a rapper, really about that. We're going to diss you about that. Yeah. Yeah. And then and you go you down. Not, <laughs> you're on your own business. You know what I'm saying? Like, and that's yeah. what's like with rap, bro. You have to say what you mean. You have yeah. to yeah. do. You, you need to be able to say, do what you say. Unless you have flowed in. Yeah. It's kind of like mess up the whole you point of being a rapper. Yeah. Yeah. You can't for no reason. Right? <laughs> you can't yeah. for no reason. Yeah. 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 So, I mean, I, I get that part because that's the only thing I was thinking of. Like, We actually had, uh, I'm not going to mention names just for the sake of just not putting anybody on blast, but we saw um, a local music video recently. I sent the, the link because myself, Steve, and I don't have a group where we just sure. discuss like yeah, podcast, yeah, yeah. podcast, podcast yeah. anything. Yeah. And then there'll be days where we just want to talk shit to each other mm-hmm. and we'll just like, we either roast these yeah. for no reason or something, yeah. you know, yeah. Some, yeah. something, yeah. just yeah. like, you know, we're just like yeah. beyond these, or we'll yeah. just be on Idol, or they'll be on yeah. me. Yeah. I was like, yo, guys, this is my turn, you know, but, and then I was like, yo, guys, um, there's a song that dropped that's been filmed in it's PE, like everything, the videographers from PE, the guys who produce a track from PE, blah, blah. So Who, who's that? I'll, t- I'll tell you afterwards, dog. I can't tell you now. But anyways, they, they <laughs> shot the video. Yo, I don't want to do it now. But anyways, they, they, they released the song, right? And it was like every every second shot was... And I know for a fact there's one dude in this video that has never even seen a gun in his life. Yeah. I know this one cat in particular. I was like... Uh, <laughs> The only it. pistol you've seen is a water pistol. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So I was like, but I'm not going to diss anybody. I left it yeah, and let it slide. Yeah, yeah. And then <laughs> I think, no, I think Steve good. said it for some reason. Either you were like, yo, I wonder if these guys even even shotgun. Because they were like, grek, 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 in this video. We need but I didn't to say anything. guys, guys. Yo, I was like, damn, guys. Hip hop. You're like, grata tang in this video. You have to be honest, blatantly <laughs> honest about yeah. hip hop. Yeah. You can't say, Chido, you dope yeah. when I just freestyle and you say, yeah, it's dope, but I freestyle shit. You can't <laughs> cheat. You know, you can't promote wackness. Because yeah. 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 at the end of the day, they support popularity over talent. Yeah. yeah. Honestly, at the end of the day. Yeah. You see? And that goes to the whole thing of like, these owners are speaking about subject matter that they. Want to please to a certain crowd, sure. you yeah, see, yeah. but they're not actually. About it's like it. your IG baddies and your IG guys yeah. that take pictures with expensive bottles and, and then return them <laughs> to the <laughs> town. Yeah, ah, bro, we know those things. Yeah. 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 But Drink what you afford in the hotel. Yeah, we're we, not, we, we, we not here to like, judge you, yeah. bro. Gee. I heard, you know what, Jida, you're telling me, yeah, bro, you're, yeah, yo, yo. <laughs> There's something that I want to bring up because Jida's talking about it now, but like these Instagram people, guys. Again, I'm, I, yo, I, I know too many people and I, I, I hate that, but I'm going to yeah. tell you now. There was this one person that I was told, right? So this person had a particular car and I'm not going to, okay, I'll mention the car, but it's, 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 it's a car that you wouldn't, I don't, I don't pin, I don't pin yeah, you yeah, because yeah, there's so many yeah, of yeah, them. Yeah, yeah. No, 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 I won't pin any, I won't pin it on anyone. I won't pin it because yeah. there's so many of this car that's around, right? Okay. But let's say, I'll make an example. Mm. Um, let's say that I, I, I owned a red polo. A red sure. polo. Let's use a red polo for as an example, right? So I heard, right, that this cat, he, that car was actually repossessed because he couldn't yeah, upkeep, yeah, yeah, yeah. right? And I was like, oh, shame. Like, damn, that sucks yeah, for this person. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Sad, yeah, mm-hmm. it's life. To maintain appearances, this homie will go into places and see a car that looked exactly like his <laughs> And he'll purposefully take like pictures oh, with that car to oh, make sure that it looks yeah, like he still yeah, got it like that. And he'll just constantly block the license plate. 
So you could not yeah, identify that it's yeah, not his car. Yeah. That's so stressful. Just <laughs> imagine the, yeah, amount, of the work, effort, the amount of work dog, you're doing the for that. effort yeah, in yeah, going yeah. in and like you Ubered somewhere yeah, by example, yeah. and then you're like, oh snap, there's a, a red yeah, polo. Yeah, yeah. Run to that shit, take a selfie or some shit, or like ask your homie, like yo, just gonna put your me in this. That's so much effort, bro. That's no, effort. That's One thing my mom told effort. me was like, never let anyone belittle belittle you, bro. Yeah. You can you, you can't even threaten me. Mm. You know that. If something is stolen there, mm. you saw it's me. I'm gonna say I stole it with you. <laughs> you I know. It. Accomplice, dog. Yeah. <laughs> I will never let anyone belittle me, dog. Yeah, mm. bro, I guess. If I fall, I, I fall. I admit I fell, guys. Yeah. I'm yeah. gonna rise again. Mm. Yeah. People don't have that because they're scared of being laughed on social media. Yeah. Social media is there for a reason. That's not yeah. real, man. It's That's not, not real. real. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? I can go to a Macosa store and say I'm going to buy, go in the fitting room, rock the whole fit, take a picture, post it three months later. You think I have it? I yeah. don't have it, dog. <laughs> And you're ballsy <laughs> saying Macosa so because that shit's not cheap, bro. Gee, the so socks alone is like 300 yeah. bucks for you a pair. You guys, don't you ain't oh, capping oh, us. Gee, they yeah, think they're sorry. capping us. Mm. Yeah, bro. Uh, um. And uh, again, the stress, like, uh, bro, don't buy a beam, but you eat peanut butter bread every night. Like, it's not oh, worth it. It's not worth it. And with his fancy two-minute noodles, you know, he wants to be lying. Yeah. And you can all tie this into, like, music also, like, into hip-hop, because you get people who are um, who trying to live a certain standard mm, because mm, it's hip hop. I have to look rich. I, I have, have to look to, like yeah. I have like trippiest clothes. I have, have swag Chains and stuff. And, that. and mm. whereas you don't even have, so even maintaining that now, mm. you kind of like, ah, I only had to do it like for a certain time. Yeah, now I can't right. do yeah. it. Funny like, thing, yeah. I was watching Dr. Oh, yeah, Smile. Do you know Dr. Smile? Nah. He's the, the grills oh, 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 dentist yeah, yeah, in okay. SA. Mm. Okay. Yeah, he was on Popcorn and Cheese. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So he was talking about how he came up with the concept of Grills. Mm. It's just a normal dentist that's into art. Yeah, oh, crazy. Sure. Now, it's not that Asian dude. No, yeah, it looks Asian-ish. Yeah, but like he's a, a, yeah, 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 no, yeah. Like a but he's a short dude. Yeah, he's a short, short dude. dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah short I know exactly. Okay, now I know you're talking about. So you. he's like the the first person that introduced him to the idea was Scoop Scoop Makatini. Shout out to OG. We don't know where you at. Please come out. We need oh, you. That's crazy. We need you. No, because he's from here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's from Kwatu, isn't it? Yeah, I think yeah, so. Yeah, we need you, good man. We need you. Oh, my God. So, mm. crazy. Scoop introduced this idea to him. Mm. AK was the first to go to Grills Day. Mm. It was not real gold. Mm. The first person to do real gold was OK Malum Kuke. OK. okay. He told him, ah, but I don't want this gold looker like. Mm. How much is it for you to get real gold A and problem, do this yeah, shit? Yeah. That's yeah. how he started his business. That's bonkers. Damn. And That's now he's, he's selling to all now the American. Now he's doing stuff. diamond grills now. Oh, yeah. like and you the know, hip music, uh, music, um, dentist. he's an industry yeah, yeah, dentist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And you know, go sit on that chair. Yeah, you made yeah, it. Yeah. Yeah. You know, you know, <laughs> you know what's crazy about that? Because like, it, it it makes so much sense. Because like, if you if you look at South African culture, um, like one of the status symbols are for a lot of the times when you like, if you look at like. Older cats now, they're like, let's call them like they're in their 60s. Mm. Okay. Some of them even maybe early 50s. 50s they'll have like, you know, those those golden like yeah. owls in their yeah. teeth. Yeah. Like yeah. They, yeah. That was like, it was a there status was a symbol. Yeah. Yeah. Even like amongst colored people, like yeah. they, would, they would do like that shit. Like I have like yeah. one gold random fucking yeah. tooth. Yeah. Especially amongst Indians, dog. They like, go to yeah. Durban, dog. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> but like back in the day, like a, a, like a real status. Yeah, yeah, thing, yeah like it, was, it was. It was. Oh, it was like cool. a thing. But it wasn't like yeah. in Durban, like they, they do in almost like the whole fucking month. But like yeah, around here, yeah. it was like it wasn't. Because I, I, I'm having flashbacks from when I was at school. Mm. And I had homies like. Maybe with the L or With the L, with like a, yeah. with like a yeah. star and like yeah. some shit. Today, that, that's a bit. Yeah. Uh, today, <laughs> I, we don't talk to you. You yeah. gotta have crazy, like, braces, yeah. fool. Oh, really? But that was, like, a thing when you, that's how, like, you knew, okay, that dude's parents have some kind of money. Mm. Yeah. Or that chick's parents have that's some crazy. kind of money because she got a gold, you know, L on the tooth uh, or you something. You can medical aid that shit. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you can medical yeah, aid that yeah. shit yeah. now, yeah. 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 That's cosmetic, yeah. dog. Yeah. Medical, they don't pay for that shit yeah. initially. Yeah. I don't know if they do it now, but, like, I know originally they were like, hell, no, we're not paying for this shit. Doesn't fix anything, That's but hilarious. yeah, but yeah, but it's How long now, guys? We don't know. We never. We didn't. Yo, guys, once we started, we just went. Yeah, <laughs> That's yeah. a podcast. I feel like, was, a podcast I feel like this is a, real, man. But I feel like this was like a topic that also needed to be 
aired out yeah, so yeah, yeah, yeah. And it was so, one of those things was like yeah. the, there are people that are when watching you know walked up he was like yeah something to it was say like yo you, <laughs> you know like press conference you, you, <laughs> when we were coming yeah, in the no, car he's like please like, don't don't do anything controversial i know you want to he was like i'm steaming he knows maybe i'll come back some other time yeah i'll come back after i've dropped the video man yeah 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 we should do that we should do that Obviously, we'll talk if off air and further about you how we're gonna man. go about it and stuff. But after all, yeah. what we plan to do yeah. happens yeah. when we come yeah. out yeah. to yeah. review. Yeah. That, what yeah. are we saying? Yeah. 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 Just to yeah. show you. Oh, where are they now? Episode. Yeah, where are they now? Yeah. 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 I like that. You yeah. 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 can't even name it that. The yeah. second yeah. episode. Where are they yeah. now? Where are they now? Otherwise, damn. But now we will speak of a further about mm. you know what all we might want to do and stuff. But yeah, guys, you no, know, this was I wish we could go three hours. Bro, it yeah, was an insightful. So much more to say and whatever. <laughs> but uh, again, part two, we'll yeah, get into yeah. it. Yeah. Okay. We think but we need to get that channel up. And you know that uh, what do we what do we say we're gonna do? Um, that thing we like we, when we're gonna get into like the real like the real nasty. And then there's like that that other like subscription like channel that yeah yeah yeah, 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 yeah. If you, yeah. you really want to know what Gino has to say, yeah, you know, you want to know. You know what I'm saying? Once we get that going, we let you know. Once we get that going, we let you know. Yeah, we don't want to get cancelled, you know. Oh yeah, can't take us out, bro. Anyways, okay, but guys, yeah, that's been. The homies, I'm still like I'm still buzzing on the things I spoke about. Yeah, <laughs> I'm uh, generally still yeah. buzzing yeah, on everything yeah, yeah. now. Oh, real, links, but links, links, but we'll, we'll links, we're gonna all get all Gito things, links, y'all. Yeah. You scroll down low, but you'll find it in the description. Oh yeah. But guys, on the on the topic of the hip hop industry, uh, m- m- mostly the hip hop and music mm, industry. Yeah, yeah. I hope you will actually learn something. I hope that 100%. like I hope that your eyes were open because like I yeah, mean I didn't so know a lot. Loki a PSA, if we will. Essentially, yeah. Yeah. No. yeah. Public service announcement but to yeah. let these people know, like yo, just put hip hop more. Like yeah, like, yeah. Okay. I mean there is a market for it. It's not like yeah. it's something that people yeah, aren't yeah, looking yeah. for. There really is a market. I would even go as far as to say there's still a market for quite your music as well. Yeah. But that's just me. That's just my thing. There, there is, there, there is. is. Yeah, but there I mean is, it doesn't really is. matter. But guys, that has been us. Well, okay. myself and oh, Steez was supposed to be here too. Oh, hey, <laughs> We're guys. gonna get into that again. Yeah, We're gonna mention yeah, it. Yeah, once you shoot Steez, we'll explain what the hell We are gonna roast his ex yeah, on the next episode. Yeah. But All of us are gonna. I'm gonna give you a call. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 To be fair, it's Iron Man today also, so the yeah, is a bit of a bit of The streets were, the were like yeah, literally yeah. shut down to these guys could cycle passes, but oh, it's yeah. okay. We we'll figured that out. But guys, that has been myself, Kicks. It's been the homie Gido. It's been the homie Taba. Been Omi Adil. We'll catch you on the flip side. Peace. Peace.